Hey, good afternoon. Kyler Hawthorne here from Veracity Motors. I just wanted to shoot you a real quick walk around video on our 2019 Ford F-150 STX. This is a really nice truck, only 32,000 miles on it. It's got that 2.7 liter EcoBoost in it, 10 speed transmission, four wheel drive, everything like that. We've got a Veracity value priced at $35,000. So I'll go ahead and show you the overall condition of it, some of the awesome features that are on it and everything like that. All right, here it is, the 2019 Ford F-150 STX. This is a very nice truck, got a really nice blue color to it. This one does have the five and a half foot box on it, and it's got that drop-in bed liner, keeps the bed nice and safe. You've also got all of your tow hookups down here, and then you've got your reverse camera on it as well. This one also has the tailgate step built into it. And so you just push this little button here. It will pop that step right out. And then you've got your handle over here on the left of that. And it makes it nice and easy to get in and out of the bed. And putting it away is just as simple. You just push this one here. And then you give this little number two lever a push down and it'll unlatch the lever for you. You just push it right back into place and then you just lift this step up and give it a little push here and it'll lock right back into place. This one's also got a very nice set of wheels as a part of that STX package and the tires on it have plenty of life left to them. Overall, this truck is in really great shape. I have not been able to find any flaws or anything like that on it. Got that really nice black honeycomb grill on the front as well, a part of that STX package. And then here's what things are looking like in the second row. Plenty of space back here on these crew cab F-150s. This one also has the vinyl floors all the way throughout it. So nice and easy to keep clean. You can sweep it out, uh, you know, of course, vacuum it out, whatever you need to do there. Uh, but don't have to worry about your carpet getting all, you know, soggy from wet boots or uh, wet shoes, mud, things like that. And then if you need more floor storage space, you can also lift those seats, lock them up into place and you've got plenty of floor storage on here as well. And here's what things are looking like up front. Again, black cloth interior on this, in really great shape. No tears, no holes, absolutely nothing like that. This one is the full bench seat up front as well. So you can fit a total of six people in this one. And here's what things are looking like from the driver's seat. Got a real nice gauge layout on here. All of your important information displayed across it. Of course, you got your RPMs there on the left, your speedo on the right, and then you've got your, uh, you know, your different gauges up top there. You've got your temperature uh, for your water, or I'm sorry, oil pressure. You've got your water temps, you've got your fuel gauge, and then of course your transmission temps. In the middle there, you've got a nice little digital display. Lots of good driving information on there for you. If you want to change any of that information, you just go to these arrows on the left side of the screen here. You can scroll up or down through the different sections available on each page. If you press the left button, it'll bring you back into the main page and you can scroll through and uh, you know select which information you're looking for. And then again, you can go up or down through those different, uh, different sections of the page. Lots of good driving information there few other steering wheel controls that you have. So over on the right side here, you've got your volume. You can also skip songs or uh, saved stations. And then that M is gonna be your different media options. If you wanted to swap from AM to FM to the Bluetooth or anything like that, you can do that pretty easily there. Over on the bottom left of the steering wheel, you've got your cruise control options. So you can turn them on or off here, set your speed, uh, increase or decrease your speed or resume a previously set speed. And then over on the right, you've got your answer and end phone calls. You can mute the system or you can bring up your voice recognition assistant as well. 
Just behind the steering wheel on the dash here, you've got all your lighting controls. So you've got the automatic headlights on this one. You can also turn those headlights on manually, or if you just want your daytime running lights on, you can do that. Uh, you've also got your fog lights, and you've got your bed lighting, and then you can also brighten or dim the instrument panels. Uh, if it's a little bit darker out, you can turn them down so you can see out of the truck a little bit easier. Over on the door, you've got all of your power mirror controls up top here got all of your power windows and then just down below that you've got your power locks this one also has five different drive modes on it so you've got your shifter here and if you just push the button on the end of the shifter you can go into those different modes so like i said five different ones here you've got your normal of course your tow haul you've also got the snow or wet you've got your eco and then your sport mode over in the center console, this is what your entertainment section is looking like. Nice big 8-inch touchscreen on here. Got pretty much all of the modern capabilities with the, uh, of course, AM and FM. You also have the Bluetooth audio, and then this one also has the Apple CarPlay built into it. So if you plug your cell phone in, it will literally put your cell phone on this center screen here. And uh, you can run apps through it, um, you know, run your music, your navigation, all of that different stuff through your cell phone right on the factory center console here. Just below that, you've got a few other radio controls. So you got your volume over here on the left and then your tuning knob on the right. And then you've got your pre-saved stations and you can also skip through those saved stations or tracks. And then that media button again so that you can change through uh, AM, FM, all of those different modes. Just above the screen, you've got your traction control button. You've got your hazards and then you can turn that auto start stop off if you would like to uh, turn it off there. Just to the left of your radio knob, you've got your four wheel drive controls. So you've got the two high, four high, and four low. And then just below that, you've got all of your different climate controls. So you can pick your zone where you want the air to be blowing. You can adjust the fan speeds with this left dial here, and then you can adjust the temperature coming out of the vents with that right dial. Just below that, you've got your USB ports, uh, charge your different phones and things like that. And then of course you've got a standard 12 volt port just to the, to the right of that. Uh, and then, like I mentioned, this is the full bench seat. Got your cup holders built in with the uh, spring-loaded uh, tensioners on there. Keep those drinks nice and tight. And then if you want to put that seat up, obviously, you just flip it up here. You've got the little latch on the right side of the seat, so if you need to drop it down, you just give that a push. Give the seat a pull, and it will drop right back down into place. Down below that, uh, just underneath the seat, you've got the under seat storage. You also have cup holders built into that as well. And so you can actually pull these out, flip them around if you need to use those cup holders, or you can have them stowed away and uh, have them tucked up underneath the seat. Gives you a little bit better floor access here. And then over on the passenger side, you've got your nice big glove box here. Plenty of storage space in here. You've got your owner's manual up top and you've still got plenty of room for storage in there. And then here's how things are just kind of looking overall on the 2019 Ford F-150 STX. So like I said, just a real quick walk around video on our 2019 Ford F-150 that we have here. If you have any questions, if there's anything else you wanna see, definitely just let me know. You can reach me here at the store, 701-258-2277. Just ask for Kyler. Thank you.